Hey friends, welcome back. Yes, I'm in my car because this seems to be the only free time I've had lately. I've been on the go and I'll explain that in a minute. But if you're new to the channel, I do hope that you enjoy what you see. This is a quick, just really quick life update um, to let you guys know some new stuff that's going on and also uh, something pertaining to the channel. Kids and I are actually on our way to Walmart. We need to exchange a toy because Jackson got too many of them. And Alice is on the hunt for an LOL surprise little sister doll. So I told her they're probably gonna be hard to find. All that aside, first of all, very important, fun, exciting news. We are almost to 10,000 subscribers, which is phenomenal. Right guys? Yeah. Are we excited? Yes. Alice, are you excited? Yes. They're back here somewhere. So we are almost at 10,000 subscribers and if you've been around a while you know that we try to do something fun at our milestone marker subscriber count. I think we're going to do another Q&A style like open question chat between my husband and I. So this is a call for questions. Drop them down below in the comments. Anything you guys want to know within reason and we will try to answer them on a Q&A segment coming up once we hit 10,000 subscribers. Also if you have any other fun ideas on um, something else fun that we could do, let me know. We struggle coming up with fun, creative ideas for our subscriber milestones. So if you have ideas, basically drop them down below. And we might even do like another of the ideas that you leave if it's something that we can do on top of the Q&A. But I do want to do a Q&A because it's been a while and those are just fun for, I think, everyone involved. So drop your questions for the Q&A. Second thing, in my last um, grocery haul, which was just put up the other day, I had many of you ask me how I was doing because you said I looked tired and sounded tired and looked a little pale and no I did not take offense to any of those questions because you're very observant. I am not feeling well and I actually thought it was kind of sweet that you noticed. Um, you can probably hear a little bit of congestion in my voice. I am, for those of you who don't know, I'm currently going through some health issues to do with my autoimmune disorder and a possible diagnosis of ankylosing spondylitis which I don't think I did an update on that. I got my blood work back on that and it came back positive. So I haven't spoken with my rheumatologist yet so I don't have like verbal confirmation. I only have like the written test results. But it's entirely possible that I have a second autoimmune disorder which is the ankylosing spondylitis and that is um, arthritis of the spine which would explain my chronic back pain for the past 10 plus years when all of my tests come back normal. So that's going on. I was in the hospital about a month ago with some intestinal ulcers due to my current diagnosed autoimmune disorder, which is called Pochette's. And I'm just, I'm going through a lot. So for those of you who noticed that I maybe wasn't feeling the best, I actually kind of appreciate that. I am on an autoimmune suppressant called Imuran and that basically, as it says, suppresses my immune system. So I've got a chest cold going on right now. I've got some sinus stuff going on. And then if you can see right here, I've got shingles. I'm at a stoplight, don't worry. I've got shingles all on my face and a small breakout over here, um, which is super painful and annoying because it's on my face. So that's going on. Other than that, I feel pretty great. I mean, my energy levels are okay. So thanks for noticing, thanks for your kind words, and no, I did not take offense. Third and final thing, because like I said, I want to make this quick. I have started a new, uh, I don't want to say job, but I have a new stream of income. If you have heard of Shipt, S-H-I-P-T, it's a grocery delivery service that is becoming pretty popular. I am now a Shipt shopper. So I'm a personal shopper for groceries. And if you know me, you know I love shopping, you know I love grocery shopping, because I do grocery hauls every week. So now I get paid to shop for other people who don't wanna leave the house because of it being too cold, or maybe they can't, or they just want someone else to do it for them, which is fine. I will gladly do your shopping. So I just started, this is literally my third day. Um, my first day I did two orders. Yesterday I did five orders, and I've already got one order um, delivery for today. And it's great because you put yourself on the schedule whenever you want to work um, and you can take yourself off and it, you schedule yourself in one hour blocks. So it fits in perfectly. I can work when I know Will's gonna be home or when the kids are in school. And then I can take myself off the schedule whenever I want. And you get a flat fee plus a percentage of their order plus any tips if they decide to tip you. So it's been good and definitely worth the, the time and energy that I'm investing into it because I live really close to the stores that I deliver for. Um, 
So yeah, sorry about the lighting, the sun's over here. But I'm gonna wrap this up. If you've never heard of Shipt, I'm gonna leave a link down below for you to check it out. Even though if you're not in my area, you can still see if they deliver to your area and you can get a two week trial for free, plus $10 off your groceries when you use my referral link. So if you want to see what it's like to have your groceries delivered, check it out. But other than that, we are almost to Walmart. We are going to go ahead and get these errands taken care of. Oh, she wants to show you something. She got an LOL doll. And this is Neon Cutie, and she's super proud of it because she's been wanting the, one of these for months, and she spent some of her Christmas and allowance money on it. So this is her new prized possession. All right, we will talk to you later. Don't forget to leave your comments, questions down below for the Q&A, and any suggestions for future or current, like the 10,000 subscriber milestone. And once we hit that, we will be celebrating together. So we'll see you later. Till next time, bye.